Should you have to pay thousands of dollars for a broken sewer line under a public street? It turns out in Colleen, that's the policy. Our own Andrew Moore is here to explain why and how you can change that. Andrew. Imani, sometimes sewer lines break, but in Colleen, around 18 homeowners risk paying thousands every year because of this policy. And there's no telling if you're going to be one of them. Of course it was shocking. Lee Huggins owns a home in Colleen. When he started having sewer line problems, he dug up the front yard to fix it, but it wasn't in his yard. The problem exists about 13 feet from my property line in the city right of way. It's under the curb at the edge of the city road. When Huggins asked the city to fix it, however, they gave him a letter that said no. That letter says that I am responsible for the maintenance all the way to the center of the street. In other words, if you own a home, you have a sewer line that connects to the main line somewhere in the street. And if it breaks under the street, you still have to pay to dig it up and fix it. Guess how much that costs? My estimate for this repair is at least 13,000 because it's 13 feet. I was very shocked. Colleen Councilwoman Shirley Fleming looked into it. She found out the city had no ordinance on the subject, but instead quoted a legal case from more than 30 years ago. She doesn't think residents should pay for lines under the roads. But beyond my property, that's what I'm really concerned about. And she wasn't the only one. Harris also questioned the policy last Tuesday. Even as a you know homeowner and citizen, I don't like the situation myself because I'd be pretty upset myself. But city staff says this problem affects 18 people a year, and they question if they should raise rates on everyone to fix it. Man, that's bad luck, you know, obviously. But do we assess a fee on the other 142000 But Huggins says no one should be suddenly forced to pay thousands for a city service. You never know when it's going to be your problem. Now, despite what city staff said, the city has not finished approving next year's budget. So if, they, if the council asks them to find room to fix this, they might. Also, the city is free to change its policy on the matter. But that might not happen unless you... Call your councilman, call your councilwoman, and tell them. Monty?